everybody. We're live at Luby's in Meyer Park. Natalie and I are having a blast at this iconic Houston restaurant, part of our behind the scenes of Houston's famous restaurants, right? And we have already tried their delicious cheesesteak, part of their Luann platter. Mm -hmm. And now we've got some healthy options they're coming up with. Exactly. And I'm so excited, Natalie. And you'll like this, because I know you are calorie aware. I like to do that, yeah. We're going to show you how to make a dish that the whole plate is okay. only 600 calories. Excellent. I can't wait. I'm ready to find out how to make it. Okay, excellent. So we have corporate chef of Luby's, Chef Marcos Leal, with us. Welcome, Chef. How are you? Thank you for joining us Thank today. You for having me. Now, what are we going to make today? Today, we're going to make uh, three dishes very quickly a uh, balsamic glazed chicken mm -hmm. with Mediterranean polenta and a uh, little tomato bruschetta. Okay, so how do we get started, Chef? Okay, uh, very simply, you take about five ounces of chicken breast. A little dry Italian. And that, that's a boneless, skinless a, breast, yes. I notice. Yes, boneless, skinless breast, a little dry Italian herb, a little kosher salt, a little bit of olive oil. We've used most of our olive oil in the marinades of all of our product. Uh, and a little black pepper. Slightly toss it with your hand, and you want to let it marinate overnight. Oh, okay. Yes, that's, that way you can enhance most of the flavors. We've yeah. already done that. This is kind of what the finished product looks like. Uh -huh. Um, then you want to take it out and, and uh, cook it on your grill or a flat top right. for uh, about two and a half minutes each side so you get a nice and good caramelization on the outside. Right. Um, and you'll do that also with the polenta. The polenta cake is like a porish used out of uh, cooked cornmeal, yes. which is a traditional Italian. Can we show the viewers what, what uh, they start with, Chef? I think yeah. that would be... This is the uh, raw polenta. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's available at any grocery store, or you, if you don't have any, you can just use a rough ground cornmeal. Uh -huh. um, and you cook it kind of like a porridge, a little chicken stock, some little water, um, bring that up to a boil till it's nice and bubbly, and you add your herbs which, and spices, which for us is uh, parsley, feta cheese, and a little sun-dried tomato. Wow, that sounds delicious. And then, Chef, when the polenta is cooked, show us the pan that you you do something different with it. Yes. Uh, to get the cake, once you get the porish kind of texture, you want to sheet it out in a cookie tray and let it cool overnight uh, so you get a nice even tray. Then you can portion it roughly about four ounces per weight, uh, which is a good portion size of starch. Yeah. Uh, and I don't do this with my polenta, Chef. This is a great tip that you're sharing with us. Right. Uh, when By grilling it, uh, you don't use any oil. You use a little cooking spray. You get a nice little crusty, uh, you get a crust on the outside from uh, caramelizing the natural sugars. Yeah, that makes nice. Yeah. And now what is the, what's the vegetable? And that's just a little blanched broccoli mm -hmm. that we have. Uh, our polenta should be ready. It's put on a plate, topped with a little bit of the, uh, or topped with the chicken. Right. About four ounces by weight of broccoli. Okay, and then I see that there's a uh, bruschetta. Yes. It's a little, a little bruschetta. Topping. All that is is a little uh, fresh diced Roma tomato, a little basil, fresh diced red onion, fresh garlic. Oh, it looks delicious, Chef. Olive oil, balsamic vinegar. Mm -hmm. Just a pinch of kosher salt like and black a pepper. Little, a little nice tomato salad, right? Correct. Uh, just mix it right before you knead it, and it gets topped right on top of it. And the then you top it on the chicken. How beautiful. Now, what's awesome about this dish, how many calories on that whole plate? It's about 580, but it's under 600 calories. That is amazing. Corporate chef, thank you so, thank much. You so much. Marcos Leal, who is the corporate chef over all 93 lubies. He's, he's quite the important man here, right? Thank you. Okay, so Natalie, what do you want to dig into? This is the best job ever, cleverly. I, I, should, I should just spend 24 at 7 with you, I think. All right, give it a whirl. I think, yeah, the polenta, yeah, that looks like good. Oh, it's delicious. Yum. It's creamy. You can taste the herbs he talked about, yes. the tomatoes, really good. I love that, and some feta cheese. Mm -hmm. All right, Nat Natalie and I are going to finish here at Luby's, but we had a blast today. Thanks to Luby's for having us here at Meyer Park. This is Cleverly for Natalie Bonke, live from Luby's. Back to you, Melissa. Back here in the studio waiting for them to bring us breakfast. It's looking good.